Welcome to Room 6, the channel dedicated to the local music scene and the people that make it, including me. I'm Josh, and today we're back at Soul Belly Barbecue for another songwriter showcase with Hal Savar. This venue is turning into a great spot to catch live music and have some good food. Once again, I also live streamed this event, and you can catch all the action after this video using the link in the description. This one was a little bit different. We got some old friends, some new friends, and everything in between. So, uh, yeah, slap on your bib, grab some water because it's getting hot out there, and let's go! The evening's host, Hal Savar, had a previous engagement that delayed him, so he asked me to fill in as the opening act. Once that was done, the show really kicked into gear with uh, Quinn Turner. Quinn's music is all about positivity and love, which the world desperately needs right now. His songwriting is simple and serene, uh, lulling the listener into a peaceful trance. Maintaining the good vibes after Quinn was Carl John, who also has a book out all about his personal life, journey, and transformation called The Journey Home. Carl's music brings a little more southern charm to things, with lyrics that are introspective yet uplifting. Up next was our slightly delayed host, Al Savar. Hal's music is energetic and catchy, which always gets the crowd amped up for more. After Hal was Daniel Herrett, another recent guest on the channel. Daniel's songs are full of interesting chord structures and relatable topics, conveyed with a strong and passionate voice. I'm glad I can call him and all the other artists on the stage at this event, future and past Room 6 alumni. Next on stage was longtime friend of the channel, Scotty Dub, always bringing the island vibes with his acoustic guitar. I recently discovered that Scotty has no problem laying down the rock with his band, too. This evening was pure Scotty, however, and as usual, he played to an appreciative crowd. If you'd like to get your music in front of a crowd, like him, hit up House of R using his social media tag in the description. After Scotty's set, he and Daniel Harrett performed a song they recently worked on together. Follow them to find out more. David Wax was up next as a surprise act. You never know what'll happen when you pop by Soul Belly for some barbecue. Showcasing great chord structures and vocal sensibilities reminiscent of Elvis Costello, David did a great job of picking up the surprise baton passed to him at the last second. Following that was Jan Jan, with a little help from her band and collaborator James Pasqua. By the time this video comes out, I will be interviewing them tonight. Time travel is weird. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out when I post that video. Jan Jan and James make a great pair on stage, and with a band, they were even better. With Jan's lyrical vocals floating over the venue as the group provided just the right accompaniment, they're always a treat to watch and listen to. Coming up next was Jazzy Fresco, bringing a little rap game to the evening and turning the venue into a nightclub for a minute. Jazzy's flow is smooth and his music is well produced with catchy hooks that linger in the ears of the audience. He's collaborated with some pretty big names, and his song Bounce hit number one on lalob.com. I'm hoping to get him on the channel soon. After Jazzy, Hal Safar jumped back on stage to finish out the night. Overall, the third installment of the Songwriter Showcase at Soul Belly Barbecue went well, and was full of great music from great people. If you want to see the whole thing, I've posted a link to the live stream down in the description. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope that you'll swing by Soul Belly Barbecue maybe on some Sunday night and uh, catch the uh, the showcase, or just swing by for some good food. You can also check out the live stream. Definitely, definitely consider subscribing and ring the bell, and then you won't miss out on any of those announcements. Other than that, if you'd like to see more videos like this, please click up here. And uh, remember to be amazing, and we'll see you next time on Room 6.